Alexander Brothers has been manufacturing top-class brass instruments since 1782. The company, based in the city of Mainz, on the Rhine River, is Germany's oldest maker of brass instruments. The special thing about Alexander Brothers is our long tradition. We're in our seventh generation now. We've been here in Mainz for more than 225 years. The Alexander sound is our secret. Everyone defines it differently. One person wants a full and heroic tone, another person wants a clear sound. So it covers the whole spectrum of what people want. And that's what makes the special sound of an Alexander instrument. Some 240 steps are needed to turn a simple brass pipe into a legendary Alexander horn. The double horn was patented in 1909 and is sold around the world. Absolute precision is needed to produce this perfect sound. Every instrument is handmade and unique. You can view the instrument like a good wine. It matures over the years. We're still on the ball and trying to improve it, but it is so well received by musicians that I believe development has reached a high stage. In 1862, Alexander Brothers wrote history by developing a tuba for the composer Richard Wagner. The Wagner tuba is a special type of horn. Alexander Brothers supply a select group of customers to this day. They include the horn players of the Berlin Philharmonic, conducted by Sir Simon Rattle. This is a rehearsal of Robert Schumann's concert piece for four horns and orchestra. This is the double horn model 103. It's been 100 years this year since the first of its kind was made, sort of an anniversary. I think what makes the horn special is the wide spectrum of sounds and tones it has, even in dynamic playing like forte and fortissimo, it has a very compact sound. This model of horn has looked like this for 100 years. There are slight technical changes, development work is still going on. Technically, it's a lot better and more durable than it was in the past, but it also sounds better. It meets the demands of a modern orchestra. Alexander Brothers have been making instruments to the very highest standards since 1782.